having a goal and knowing what exactly is it that you want is just the beginning and when you don't have a plan you are bound to fail and according to research 92% of people fail to achieve their goals but this year you're not going to be one of them you are going to achieve your most important goals this year so join me to know how you can do this the reasons why we fail to achieve our goals are many clearly not defining them not working on them constantly giving up too soon losing motivation and most importantly the fear of failure which is setting us up for failure even before we start acting upon our goals but even if we manage to get past all this if we don't have an action plan we are bound to fail so it's time to create an action plan which actually works for us so firstly make sure you set smart goals which are specific when we identify the areas of our life which need improving it's also essential to be specific what exactly is it that we want to change about that area of our life if it is your diet you want to improve this year it's not enough to say i want to eat healthy it's important to clearly define what exactly will you eat and what exactly you will stop eating the times you're going to eat is it a plant based diet or a normal diet any changes to the cooking habits the use of oil what kind of oil are you going to use how much oil are you going to use being specific about your goals is the key here and your goals have to be measurable when your goals are not measurable it might be less motivating for us to continue so quantify your goal in some way and this will help you track the progress and keep moving forward track the amount of calories count the number of desserts or refined foods we are eating to limit their number all this can be a way of creating measurable goals and your goals have to be attainable what are the means by which you're going to attain your goal are the resources you have enough to attain your goal or do you need more resources are there any obstacles in your way of achieving this goal so break down your goal into smaller chunks to approach your goal in steps and your goals have to be relevant is the goal relevant to your bigger goals and aspirations does it coincide with who you want to become in the next year or is it not a contributing factor for your ultimate purpose you want to achieve your goals need to be relevant to your bigger purpose or your bigger picture of yourself and your goals have to be time bound not having deadlines will make place for things like procrastination laziness and this will lead to slow progress or no progress at all in your goals so always set a deadline for each goal and always associate a smaller goal with a date to have the motivation and driving force to make you achieve it so when we have mapped out our goals like this the next step is to identify the tasks involved when you set smart goals break them down into smaller goals or tasks to achieve the big picture define all the tasks that are essential to help you reach your goal now when it comes to new year resolutions we have a lot of areas in our life to focus upon so choose one major goal from each area of your life which you think is the most important right now and break it down into tasks involved and when these tasks are achieved one by one your ultimate goal is finally achieved and you can move on to the next goal the key here is to be as detailed as possible to identify all the tasks that are needed for you to accomplish that goal so the next step is to set a timeline we need to be time bound with anything or laziness procrastination will kick in and this will scrap your goals altogether so set a specific deadline for each of the tasks that you have identified and try to complete those tasks no matter what and when you achieve all your deadlines one goal is accomplished the next step is to track your progress The most important part of a good action plan is to track your progress regularly to give you the motivation you need and show you if you need to make any changes to your plan or to your approach in the plan. So once you set your goals, brainstorm your tasks, put the list of tasks in a place where you can see them every day and tick them off when you complete 
each of those tasks and with each tick you will have a great sense of accomplishment which will propel you to do more you can set reminders on your phone or use any apps which can help you with tracking the progress anything which suits you and you feel comfortable with and the next step is to reward yourself when we are working so hard on achieving our goals it is important to reward ourselves for every milestone that we have achieved so make sure to define what your reward is going to be after you achieve each goal and make it a point to reward yourself every step of the way not because you have to but because you deserve it so for example you're waking up every day at 6 a.m after one week just reward yourself by waking up at 7 or 7 30 because it's hard work to work towards our goals and and rewards like this will help us to be motivated and stay on track and an action plan is not something which ends or terminates abruptly it is something which is flexible volatile and keep modifying it and reviewing it regularly to suit your situations and do not give up on your dreams too early because creating action plans will help you stay motivated but that doesn't mean they are easy sometimes you want to stay in bed you don't want to do something which you should do in order to reach your goal but if you stop even for one day the path of least resistance will become a habit and procrastination laziness and other things will definitely kick in and they will stay longer than needed which will finally scrap your goals so never ever give up on your goals even for a single day but if you have to reduce the time you work on your goal for that day if you don't feel motivated enough but don't put it off altogether for another day so i hope i was able to give you some insights into a good action plan for your goals that you have now create your action plan which will help you become who you want to be in the next year and start working on these goals today so i wish you all the best and i'll see you in this video right here and until then take care